Newbie reporting for duty. The season three, week two challenges have dropped and they're pretty amazing. Only two weapons needed to complete the whole thing. You can use more than two if you want to, of course. And we even have a challenge that doesn't specify a recommended weapon, though I don't know if I would try that one without a recommended weapon. Shotgun centric and a battle rifle challenge. The first one, get 30 quick scopes with a recommended battle rifle. Get 20 operator kills with a scope equipped to a suppressed shotgun. That's an interesting one. Get 10 operator long shot kills with a KV broadside. Now we're specifying the shotgun. Get 15 operator Kingslayer kills in a single match. So that doesn't specify a recommended weapon there. Get 20 operator clean kills with recommended shotguns. Get 15 double kills with recommended weapons. And we'll already have a class set up for a recommended battle rifle and one for a recommended shotgun. And then get 15 operator quick scope kills shortly after sprinting with a recommended shotgun. So the way I broke these out, decided, like I said, two weapons. The first is gonna be the KV broadside, and we'll go over the configuration in a second. The second's gonna be the Sidewinder. The Bass B does not qualify as a recommended weapon. So we can group the 20 kills, the 10 long shots, the 20 clean kills, the 15 double kills, and the 15 quick scopes shortly after sprinting with the KV broadside, though, we can also group the five King Slayer kills in a single match with the battle rifle quick scope challenge. So let's take a look at the weapons and how I set them up. So like I said, I'm using the Sidewinder for the recommended battle rifle. It's a great weapon since the buffs. I used to think it was horrible. And here's how I set it up. The KV broadside is the important configuration. All right, so 25 shell drum, that's a no-brainer. I'm gonna start out with the 12 gauge explosive slug, and the reason being is that the effective damage range goes up 191%. So that gives us an opportunity for those long shot kills, as well as, if you take a look at the damage, if you can get one to the head, it is 162 damage. I put the Mark III reflector on it, but we'll see if that counts as a scope. It does count for magnification on the other challenges in the past, so we'll see. If it doesn't, we'll change it. All right, there it is. Let's go in and see what happens. There's our strategy. German Field Marshal Helmuth von Molke said, no plan survives first contact with the enemy. And this clown here, I didn't survive one second after the final countdown for the game to start. He ended up dropping a nuke on our heads and 193 kills with three quarters of the game gone. I was ready to give up at that point. But I did score some points on the board there. I got 19 suppressed shoddy kills. There's the 20th in the very next map first kill. And there's the first completed weekly challenge. Clean kills are gonna come next. Just need 20 of them. Double kills count. Long shots count. And killing the king five times in one match counts. So everything's on the board right now. There's a long shot. I used the slugs, the exploding slugs. There's another long shot to give me the extra range. Another long shot, so we're, we're putting points on the board at least. And I got two challenges done. The second one I guess didn't show. I got the 20 clean kills also completed. Now look at there, let me show you how much or how hard Grandpa Newbie works for you. There's a double kill. A quick scope with a shoddy shortly after sprinting. And we're going to end it up. There's a quick scope with a long shot. 
and I check after each quick scope at the beginning with the shoddy and then with the battle rifle just to make sure you should load in all the challenges on your in-game tracking there you go I'm checking I died a few times while I was checking but that's okay because then you can make in-game adjustments if the in-game adjustments happen to be working the software is right if the world is one with you there's another long shot so we're racking up these long shots and also the the quick scopes after sprinting there are three items completed we completed the long shots on that one you can see them coming in this counts as a quick scope and you can pull the trigger more than one time and still get a quick scope that's a quick scope I think just need two more I still need one more one of those didn't count and that surely that counts nope oh gosh there's a double kill there's another double kill so these weekly challenges were kind of nice in that multiple things could happen at once and I did get the the quick scope it did it didn't flash again I mean sometimes it does sometimes it doesn't and I thought I was off to the races with double kills there then I realized that's the holger that's not a battle rifle I intend on the sidewinder my finger messed up that did count as a quick scope there there's another quick scope you can see that I pull the trigger more than once because you can't get a one-shot kill to the head with this recommended battle rifle I have 21 of them completed 11 of the double kills and as we're going along we're gonna get five kills on the king we're gonna gack Elvis five times in one game a few times that was completely unnecessary this is a quick scope you can see I'm holding down the trigger there's 22 out of 30 we go to the next map looking for double kills and quick scopes and Gak and Elvis five times and hey the blaze event has started I didn't even realize that and I've completed the first challenge need five more quick scopes I don't know if that counted and there's a double kill and we're complete with the double kills we just need to complete this quick scope so there's Elvis just gacked him got an, another double kill but who cares here's the 29th quick scope and you can see I just kind of slid in aimed in and pulled the trigger that should be the 30th and it is so now I switch to the jack jawbreaker on the KV it's more like a AR and I'm sure you don't want to see every time I killed the king five times because that's boring because it just happens during the game you'd have to hang with newbie and you, you may be allergic to it but one of the things I do is off the bell run out there and just gack somebody because it's likely that person's gonna be the king especially if they're forward look how look how far you can you can shoot this thing like I said an AR slash SMG slash shoddy there's a fourth that poor guy I killed him and then I killed him right after he spawned looking for one more I guess he's no no longer the king here's the fifth and I, I celebrate by buying the farm so there it is all seven completed weekly challenges wasn't that difficult the hardest thing was just the time it took to for the five king slayers there they are with the completed logo and if you're with me I appreciate a like and subscribe it helps my family and me and I enjoy the community we're building here's what it does for you the jawbreaker I enjoyed it. There'll be another video coming out.
Peace.